In this video, we will import our captured data into Cyclone Register 360. We will see how our data that was pre-registered in the field is imported, check the setups and the tags, finalize the bundle, and then produce a report and publish a deliverable LGS file. This video will not go into detail on how to use Register 360. Directly after opening Register 360, we create a new project and enter a project name. Using Windows Explorer, we find our data on the USB stick and simply drag the folder containing the data into the import area. After a few seconds, a preview of the data appears. We can see our four setups from the field and the links we made between them. A preview of the scan data from each setup also appears. This ability to visualize a preview of the pre-registered data with the position setups and links before even importing is because we use Field360 to align and link the setups. We will now start the import process by pressing Import. Register360 now imports the full dataset and processes all of the setups. It will use our pre-registration from the field as guidance but use the full datasets to recreate the links. The process takes some time. Once the import is complete, we see an overview of our complete dataset. We will go to the bundle cloud to get a better view of it. We can click on each of the setups and see a preview of the captured image. We can also see our tags we created and attached and by clicking on one of the tags, we can see a preview of the tag. In this case, the photo we took from our third setup. If we double click on a setup, we can go to the setup cloud and see a 360 degree panoramic view of the setup. We can pan around the setup where we can see the other setup positions and also some of our tags that we attached to our data. And we could view the details of them if we wanted. Now we are finished checking our data, so we will return to our sitemap. Selecting the bundle again, we can check that our bundle errors are acceptable. We don't need to optimize our bundle, as we have not made any changes since the data was optimized on import. So we can go to the finalize tab. Here we need to create an image of our sitemap for the registration report and so accept the sitemap image as it is shown. In the Report tab, we can configure our report and decide to which formats to publish our data. We will fill out some basic information for the report and then go to our Publish options. Here we select to output our data in the LGS format and finally press Publish to create the report and the output data. The data will be published into the LGS file format, which can then be further managed by a range of products such as Cloudworks, TrueView and Jetstream.